The Harris Galveston Subsidence District's mission is to prevent subsidence in Harris and Galveston counties through the regulation of groundwater withdrawal. To understand what the district does and the importance of achieving its mission, it's best we start with recognizing our relationship with water, how it is sourced, and the impacts of groundwater usage in our area. Hi, my name is Mike Turco and I'm the General Manager of the Harris Galveston Subsidence District. Historically, the greater Houston area has relied on pumping groundwater through wells that pull water from the aquifers beneath us. The aquifers in our region are composed of deposits of sand, silt, and clay that are saturated with water. When groundwater is pumped, the water level within the aquifer begins to decline, causing the clay and silt to compact. This compaction is then seen at the land surface as sinking or subsidence. The process is slower than other types of natural hazards, but it has contributed to serious issues in our area, including faulting and damage to infrastructures like roads, bridges, pipelines, homes, and buildings. With Houston's proximity to the Gulf of Mexico and rising sea levels, any changes to land elevation from subsidence can pose a significant threat from coastal weather-related issues like storm surges and flooding. One of the most well-known instances of subsidence in our region can be seen at the Brownwood subdivision. In the 1940s, Houston's industry was booming, resulting in a growing population and a demand for more housing. The Brownwood subdivision was developed in Baytown, a Houston suburb, as a 450-acre waterfront community with over 400 homes. Unfortunately, with the growth and the increase of groundwater withdrawal in the area, the neighborhood sank over nine feet over a span of four decades. After years of devastating storm surges, flooding, and infrastructure issues, the Brownwood community was forced to abandon their homes. Eventually, the property turned into a nature preserve. With the impacts of subsidence increasingly being felt throughout the Gulf Coast region, the Texas Legislature took action in 1975 and created the Harris-Galveston Subsidence District, the first of its kind, to provide a solution that would prevent future subsidence by reducing reliance on groundwater through groundwater regulation and promoting water conservation in Harris and Galveston counties. Since then, the district has been successful and internationally recognized for lowering subsidence rates by implementing a regulatory plan that provides goals for designated areas within its regulatory boundary to reduce overall groundwater withdrawal to a specific percentage and source the majority of their water through sustainable alternative water sources, like treated surface water, all within a reasonable timeline. The regulatory plan has evolved throughout the years and continues to be reviewed and updated to make sure that the plan is both obtainable and successful in preventing subsidence. When designing this regulatory plan, the district's science and research program utilizes the most recent data collected through a variety of credited methods to better understand aquifer characteristics, measure compaction, and develop a trusted methodology to map out subsidence in the region. We work with federal science agencies like the U.S. Geological Survey and the National Geodetic Survey, along with prominent universities, leveraging their expertise and resources for the highest quality data. Better data leads to improved understanding and ultimately to more successful planning. Because subsidence is a regional issue, we also collaborate with state and local agencies like the Texas Water Development Board, groundwater conservation districts, and water providers to create solutions that minimize subsidence and develop sustainable alternative water supplies for the greater Houston area. The district is proud of the progress that our region has made since 1975. However, we still have work to do to reduce our reliance on groundwater, which is why we implemented our award-winning water conservation program. The program encourages better relationships with water and provides education, tools, resources, and partnerships to make each drop of water go further. Water is vital to our everyday lives. However, it is not a limitless resource. We must protect our natural resources while ensuring this necessity is readily available to all, not just today, but for future generations to come.